glad to have you back. You're watching TVC News Hour. The National Universities Commission has given its approval for the State University for Science and Technology after the State Governor Ibrahim Dankwambo presented a strategic document and the request for approval at the Commission's headquarters in Abuja. TVC's Larry Adeyemi reports that the new institution brings the number of universities in the state to three. To the effect from today, Thursday, 26 October 2017, the Gombe State University of Science and Technology, Kumo, has been recognized. The Executive Secretary of the National Universities Commission, Professor Abu Bakr Rashid, announced an approval for the establishment of Gombe State University of Science and Technology, Kumo. But the education sector in Gombe did not always have it this good. In 2011, only 18 out of over 15,000 students from public schools that sat for the senior school certificate examination in Gombe State passed. This was blamed on years of neglect of the education sector. Governor Dankwambo says the approval granted by the National Universities Commission is a vindication of the priority that his administration has given to education. We have successfully reoriented and redirected the thinking of the majority of our youth to pursue education which is the bedrock of the, for the development of any society. In the light of this, our administration has undertaken massive improvement of the education sector. Dan Kwambo also allayed the Executive Secretary's concerns, reassuring him that both tertiary institutions will be well funded. We do not compromise the quality, and we shall not. We do not want glorified primary schools or secondary schools labeled and called universities. The emergence of the new university will not discourage us from funding, like you said some other governors do, the existing university. Our hope, our prayer, is not that we will be one of the best. Our hope and sincere desire is for it to be the best. The establishment of a University of Science and Technology would improve access to tertiary education and provide technical training. Two things that are crucial to the rapid development of the state. Larry Adiemi, TVC News.